Hey guys, Wolfie020 here with another Minecraft update. This update consists of the tower that you see here and the medieval castle that will be behind it right now. The tower currently is useless. I've added one thing to it, and that is a red hidden redstone entrance in the floor. The tower is climbable, as you see. You can go up the stairs and it gets you a nice view of the paintball arena and the rest of my world and I was wondering if you guys could actually comment below with an idea of what I could have the tower for the use of it so you can see the wood block on the floor and when I press one of these levers Wood block goes down with a triple piston extender and it leads to a secret passageway. And I need to make a better way to get top. Back up instead of jumping. So please leave a comment down in the section below for a use because I currently do not have a clue I could use it for. Next, I'll be showing the anticipated castle. The castle was made by Madness64, it has a complete tutorial on it. But the only thing that I changed was the interior, because his video for the interior was lacking some good interior design. I made it in 1.8.2, so it's going to look a lot more choppy without the upside down stairs or half slabs, but I managed to finish it anyways. So this is the interior that I've made. I kept the design of the floor, the bottom floor layer of the castle from his video and the rest is all designed by me. So as we go upstairs you become you enter the library, which looks really neat, and has some chests full of papers and books and whatnot. The next floor is the main area to sleep, and it has a giant table, a lot of furnaces, and a great view. There's two beds, a lot of chairs looking toward the outside, and there's a lot of openness, but it also feels cozy at the same time. Here's the spiral staircase leading to the tallest tower. The highest tower is really big, and it gives you an even greater view of my world. And as you can see, there is my main area. Um, here's a view of the castle and the beacon from the overhead. Now as we go back down, I will show you the outside part of the castle, which is accessible through the middle floor and the two towers out front. The next episode will be on the medieval terraces, which were designed by Jamsy Boy Minecraft, who I am also subscribed to. I recommend if you like medieval things that you get. You just got a glimpse there of the terrace on the right if you want to go back. But he had some. He has great gothic designs, but they also are similar to medieval designs, in my opinion. Right here is one of the smaller towers. And you can see the entrance to the castle. <clears throat> and you can also see the larger tower. Now, finally, I'm going to show you a secret passageway that I thought was pretty neat. And this is actually really 
really compact redstone. I, I even amazed myself how compact I could make it with the pistons going either pressure plate. Here is an underground hidden storage room. None of the chests are filled. And only the top ones are accessible because chests are currently solid blocks within Minecraft or Xbox 360. Now we will be leaving the castle. Hope you guys had a great listen and subscribe.